<laughs> what did you get to eat, Rach? Cheesecake. <laughs> it was the best cheesecake. Like literally the best cheesecake I've ever tasted. It was like melt in your mouth, right? Rach is scoffing the last of it. <laughs> and look at our view. Like, okay. Well done. Yes. Okay, hi, my name is Rachel. This is my mom. I say we love to travel the world together. Take five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are you ready? Yeah. You serious face Show me love. Show me love. There are six national parks in the Republic of Ireland and we will be exploring five of them. We already visited the Wicklow Mountains and today we are in Killarney. Killarney is the oldest national park in Ireland, has the only indigenous herd of red deer and contains the best preserved old growth oak, yew and alder groves. Cairnmere makes a great base for exploring the national park in the Ring of Kerry. The village is famous for its Irish lace making tradition and we had great fun exploring on foot and by horseback. Their wishes on the hawthorn tree. So hawthorn trees uh, were pretty sacred and they were actually often found near pagan sites and so because of the fact that they were sacred they weren't ever cut down and really their flowers or branches could only be picked um, with uh, reverence and sometimes for brides on their wedding day. So the trees often remain at sacred sites and because of that um, they have, they're believed to have the power to fulfill wishes and they're seen as portals between the mortal and fae worlds. just finished our uh, ride at River Valley Stables and it's been pretty much four months since I last rode um, and so I really missed the horses and I really, really missed um, riding at home and so this was really a really incredible experience and um, it was just the two of us and um, we got a chat with our guide and she took us up through the mountains um, on their back roads um, and there were some really beautiful just uh, viewpoints and overall it was just a really cool experience and um, and it was definitely a, a great way to see the country from a different viewpoint so I really enjoyed it. Muckrose House is a 19th century Victorian mansion which is most famous for hosting Queen Victoria. 
The queen was paranoid about being trapped by a fire, so the owners had to build a special fire escape door from her quarters into the gardens. I highly recommend exploring the grounds and visiting the nearby abbey by jaunting cart. Hello, Rocky. Where are you from? We are from uh, Oregon in the United States. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're here for a couple weeks to kind of road trip around the entire island and two weeks, yeah, two weeks. Yeah. Yep. Muckross Abbey was built in 1448 and is another of Cromwell's casualties. In the centre of the garth is an ancient yew tree, believed to be as old as the abbey itself. It miraculously survived the destruction and is thought to be the oldest of its species to be found in Ireland. The National Park is dotted with ruined castles and abbeys, but it is the three lakes nestled among their rocky ridges which are the main stars of the show.
think I, I think you should just leave me here. I think I'm gonna live here. You know, we've just I mean we're hiking the da gap of Dunlow and it's so beautiful and it was quite a cozy spot and the little, little village of Kenmare was was beautiful and just the right size and with lots of cute little pubs and the Ross Castle was just one of the many amazing castles just littering the countryside with the views of the lake and this is this is my spot this is where i'm gonna be this is what we got. Show me <laughs>